Hey guys, we'll be starting very soon. We are just got the clock started about a minute early. We're going to do a mystery box in on day and some fan mail. Give me about 20, 30 seconds and I will be there. Well, good morning, guys. How is everybody doing on this Saturday, January the 25th? I want to appreciate everyone that stopped in so far today. We're going to do a mystery unboxing. I got a box here from Donatella Bottolino. If anyone knows that she does the auctions, and I'll put her uh, link in the afterwards if you're watching this on the replay in the iCard. Uh, actually, I'll put it even in the description below. But if anyone's interested, you go over to uh, Donatella Bodolino and tell her that Pat Deese sent you and, uh, you know, a mystery box. So this is my first uh, mystery box opening uh, this year. And um, I picked today to do it and stuff. Actually, a busy week. I um, Hello. Hey, sweet warrior. Uh, real quick, I see, I see we got about 14, 15 people in the room. There's only a couple people said hello. So Arthur Leslie, thanks for stopping. Jacob and uh, Sweet Warrior. Hey, uh, T, good morning. How are you? Thank you for stopping. Um, it's actually not too bad. We were supposed to get some snow, and um, I guess it's only rain out there. I guess it was a little slippery this morning. Hey, Georgina, how are you, honey? Hey, Donatella, how are you? Uh, Georgina, it's late for you, so thank you for stopping in. Uh, Big Red, thank you. Um Again, we're going to be doing the unboxing, which, uh, and then we're going to be doing. Uh, oh, that's that's another favor I want you guys to do. If you get a chance, go over to. I have a, a link in the description for the video. Go over to Taco Stacks. I hung out with Taco Stacks this week at a uh, storage auction, and today's his birthday actually. And uh, if you guys could uh, go over there and say, "Hey, um, happy birthday, Pat D sent me." I'd greatly appreciate it. So, um, you know, a lot of people don't know it's his uh, birthday. Uh, Patricia Shelby, thank you for stopping in. Um, it's his birthday today, so um, go over and pay the favor. So um, when I actually met up with him, I'll show you this real quick. Uh, I like Mike Schmidt. Mike Schmidt is my uh, favorite uh, all-time ball player. He played for the Philadelphia Phillies. And um, this is he, – uh, he had gotten a hat. I mentioned it in a video – He's like, oh, I'll save it for you. And sure enough, when we met up, uh, he gave this hat to me. And no charge, actually, free, he gave it to me. And um, not, much, not much of a ball. Uh, I don't wear – it says one size fits all. I don't know about that. My head's a little bit too big for uh, – in it to flip it. Hey, Susie, how are you? Um, but uh, Taco Stacks gave me this hat for free. We hung out the other day about six hours. Um had to take a break. Had to take a break. I don't look too bad. I mean, my head's like a big watermelon to be fitting the hat on, but I just like uh, I'm gonna keep it as a collectible and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, Taco Stacks. So do me a favor again. Make sure you go over to Taco Stacks uh, channel. Hi, Darlene, uh, and uh, wish Taco Stacks. I did post uh, his latest video in uh, below and just say, hey, Pat D sent you because he he's he's a good kid, you know, and I always refer to him as a kid because. He's like the same age as my uh, oldest son that I have, and uh, uh, very uh, humble and laid back, and uh, he's he's been good to me. So uh, let's get started. I want to get started with the fan mail, actually, I got. Um, yeah, my birthday is coming up on uh, February the 6th, and uh, Treasure Hustlers is supposed to be hanging out with me that night. I talked to uh, Jackie and Sarah last night, and uh, – we had talked probably about a week ago and stuff like that. I actually just, you know, it's 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 25th of uh, January already, and I just got back from, I got back from Florida around the 9th or the 10th. But when I, unfortunately, when uh, on the way home, we got into a little bit of fender bender. And um, hey, uh, Jennifer Hayes, thank you for stopping. And I got sick. So, um, <clears throat> you know, it's it's kind of been, I can't believe how fast, actually. I mean, we're almost already in February. So, hey, uh, 
Flipping frozen. Yeah, we got actually I saw your post earlier. It's about 35. Yeah, if you guys could give me thumbs up. And, and that's another thing, too, is I'm trying to grow. It says in that little banner there, uh, please subscribe to my channel. If you guys could check out my other channel, Pat's Hall. On there, I, I talk about health and wealth. Uh, if anyone doesn't know, I, I was going through cancer for um, – I had cancer three years ago and had surgery and 41 rounds of radiation. Fun stuff, fun stuff. <laughs> but uh, on there, I talk about it a little bit, and I want to get focused back on it again. Uh, but I, I talk a lot of really about business, the market, uh, you know, credit cards. So I'm going to really start pushing that channel because uh, I want to have a channel that basically teaches people uh, about – money and business and stuff from the experience that I've had with over 800 employees and stuff like that. And, and, and kind of keep, even though we do reselling is a business and stuff like that, but just really to kind of keep those separate because really on this Pat D's channel, I, I try to show even fun stuff like it was just down to Disney world. And, you know, we do those trips and, and when I travel to different places and stuff like that. So just really to kind of keep that separate. Oh, T, thank you for posting the link. I appreciate that. So let's start. I don't, I, I mean, you know, it's always a unique thing when you get people, fans, uh, I, I, I call them. Um, hey, uh, Jonathan, thank you for uh, stopping in. I appreciate it. Um, we're going to be doing a, a, a Donatella uh, mystery box, uh, but we're going to start out. It's it's nice when you complete strangers, and and I say that you know because you get the do you get the gnome, on but you know there's some people. Uh, right before I left, actually, I got this uh, Pet D's. I've I've probably got about fifteen. I tell you, since doing YouTube last year, I've probably got about fifteen things in the mail uh, so far um, from people. So. You know, obviously, greatly appreciate it. So here, here's the first card I got, and I'll share it with you guys. It was funny because it said, you know, it's Pat D's, and the person that sent it to me is actually only about um, 25 miles away. So I was like, wow, someone that close is actually watching me, which I was kind of surprised. But it's a Christmas card. It says Christmas blessings, and um, I'm going to read the note to you. It says, hi, Pat. I'm sure you already noticed that we're almost your neighbors. Sure, enjoy your rides and your um, uh, or videos. I'm sorry. Enjoy. It's cursive, so it's a little bit sometimes harder to read. Um, sure, enjoy your videos and your heart for charity. Please accept this $20 anywhere you see fit. My husband and I uh, we need to start clearing out stuff. Thanks. Too much stuff. There are children who won't be interested in it. In it. I'm going to try to get stuff together and... Um, if you would like to be interested, not ready yet, but hope to get it together soon. So just give me your email. Um, may God bless you and the family and keep you safe and healthy. Cindy Simone. Um, oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you for stopping. So yeah, sent me $20. <clears throat> hey, Tracy, thanks for stopping in and, um, a nice card. So what I did is the, you know, basically gave me the $20 and, um, so uh, Pete Craigless Hunter had a um, – I don't know if you guys follow Craig, but he he had a story where a guy, a vet, come in, um, you know, and, and had it basically wanted to sell his grandfather's medals and stuff like that, was living in a van and needed surgery. So what I did is – and I knew I had gotten the $20, so I made a donation of $20 towards the GoFundMe. Uh, so I took the $20 and I paid it forward. Uh, and towards that vet on uh, Craigless Hunter, and they and they raised like fourteen thousand dollars for him. Uh, they, if, I don't know if you guys had seen that, but they had originally had done it where they listed his medals up on eBay, and um, somebody had bid uh, bid on him, and uh, nobody paid it. So um, you know that that was a nice story, and uh, he, then he had posted that hey he'll give the the medals back to uh, the gentleman. You know, and he set up the GoFundMe. So the twenty dollars I got, I paid it for it. You know, um, it was a kind gesture to send it to me. I, I don't mind doing that, um, and I appreciate it. And I, I just want to acknowledge. Now I did get another one here, and this is from um, a viewer that we all know. Usually, if you if you're following Donna and T and myself, is from Myra. Uh, Myra, I don't, I don't want to put her name up here too much because uh, it has, well, it only has her post office box, but she lives down in Jacksonville, Florida, and she sent me a card, 
And um, I just actually just got this two days ago. Um, so it's a season's greetings. It, there's something in it. Oh, okay. There is a ornament in it. If you guys can see that. It's very nice. It says, I am the light of the world. The words of Jesus Christ, John 8, 12. Now, if anyone doesn't know that follows me, and I have it in the description below, uh, the 16 questions, is I keep a Christmas tree up year-round, and what I decided to do this year was um, appeal to you guys, appeal to uh, fellow YouTubers, fellow viewers, to uh, every week I want to put a new ornament up on a tree that's donated by people um, from the community. But I don't want people to go out and buy something new. I want like go up in your attic. Maybe you found one from a flea market, from a garage sale. You know, sometimes to be honest, we come along our way. Hey, Victoria, thank you for stopping in. And um, and every week. And then what I would do is when I add to it, I will feature it on Instagram. And then from time to time, I'll talk about it on YouTube. With the goal, basically at Christmas time, is to have the tree filled. Uh, and the tree is, is, I mean, I'm sitting here in my uh, dining room area and looking into the living room, and the, and the tree is in there. And uh, I, I, I got the first one. I got that from uh, Kissimmee down in Florida. And I got um, a figure skating uh, lady, the Japanese figure skating lady that's going to go on the tree. And actually, I, I don't have it right here in front of me, but the first person who sent me an ornament was Locker Nuts. Uh, he sent me an ornament that had the Mickey Mouse ears, uh, Jack. Uh, so if you guys follow Jack from Locker Nuts, make sure, hey, yeah, uh, you know, I, I understand you sent Pat D's a um, ornament and stuff like that. So um, I have the lights flickering here a little bit. I'm going to adjust the light. Give me a second. All right. Hope that helped a little bit. So I put on the spotlight, the, the light that I used, I think so, the, the, the light that I use um, to, um, you know, take pictures and stuff like that. They actually have it now, and I just got this uh, Toy Story background. They have it now with StreamYard that you can do a green screen, but you have to put a green up in the back, and then you can upload an image. So that that's a neat feature. So this is... Going back to the ornaments, the, the goal is then, at, you know, and I and I and I, I like Christmas. I like the attitude that people are friendlier year round. It, or um, is it my connection, or is Patrick blurry and pixelated? Oh, I don't know. Oh yeah, I see that. Let me see that. He is a little blurry. Yeah, I see that. Hold on a second, Josh. Are you watching it all? Says I'm blurry. Well, why didn't you say something? All right. Um, yeah, Pat's Hall is a different channel. You are blurry. Yeah, no one. Uh, the quality of the internet. Hold on a second, guys. Let me. Let me. Uh, and we got 25 people in here now, and I don't want to. And that's the problem. See, when I'm watching it on Streamyard, you don't notice it, and it's the feed. Uh, so let me, let me try to fix this real quick, and uh, I'll.
Okay, guys, so we're back here. We live. I don't know how we're gonna look. Uh, you know, that's that's part of the problem. Um, you know, Streamyard says that even if an, an older computer. I mean, this computer, to be honest, is about two or three years old, but is not used for much. But it should work fine. Now, most of the times, it does. You know, that's part of the problem when you're kind of doing this yourself. You don't know. So even if, you know, I have know I've watched Donna and T that if one of them have to go out, at least the other one's there to kind of carry it. Um, and, you know, it's okay. Anyone want to come to Allentown, help sort all these books I bought? <laughs> so how, how am I looking now, guys? Am I looking clear? Hey, Larry, thank you for stopping in. It seems to be clear. Uh, I'm looking at it on the cell phone. It seems to be clear. So I, I apologize for that, guys, having to step away a minute or two. I have it going on the cell phone. Uh, is, I don't know. It, it, we got 30 in the room right now. Um, what, give me If you guys could comment, how does it look? Oh, it's clear? All right. Thank you, guys. I appreciate that. I'm really sorry about how to step away there, but it's, I guess, part of what what happens. But um, – um, and you don't know it because if you're when you're looking at the stream yard, you know, stream yard looks clear, but then I guess the feedback through YouTube, it you know, uh, is when it's blurry. And I didn't have my phone, and then when I pulled it up, um, yeah, so what I did is I just rebooted the computer, uh, but then you get you lose two or three minutes. So I came back with 30, I, I came back clear. Come on, guys. So if you guys could hit the thumbs up, I apologize. Thanks for waiting. Um, we're gonna do that unboxing very soon. Um, I don't know. There was, there was, did you guys go out to the lobby and get popcorn and stuff like that? So, <laughs> um, but I was talking about the ornaments and what I'm hoping is that at the end of the year, uh, basically the tree is filled with all these ornaments that were donated from people from YouTube and that they, you know, they came from thrift shops, they came from garage sales, they came from state sales and stuff like that. And, um, but I want to read the card real quick. And, um, this card is, was from Myra. Uh, it says, Season's Greetings. It says, Dear Patrick, may you keep the spirit of giving in your heart the entire year through. Myra. Um, and then she puts her uh, – I don't want to put her channel name because I'm not sure if she wants to share it. Um, but thank you, Myra. I, I, I appreciate it. And like I said, I do have an ornament, which I will show. Um, this ornament will go on the tree. And uh, I do have an ornament from Locker Nuts. So I got two in so far. Now, I've had several people reach out to me and say, Pat, they're going to send an ornament in. But the problem is they don't think of Christmas like I do year-round. So sometimes it, it'll be like when they kind of go, oh, yeah, we got to send Pat D's a, uh, um, you know, a Christmas ornament and stuff like that. We, hey, we got 25 people in the room. You guys do me a, ch uh, a favor. Make sure you hit that thumbs up and get a chance today. I hung out with, like I said, Taco Stacks. Go over to Taco Stacks, and there is a, a video in the link in his channel and go over there and say happy birthday. Pat D says it's a special day or something like that. Pat D sent me and uh, I'd greatly appreciate that. That's to show my appreciation for him uh, giving me the hat. And uh, so Arthur asked me, is it really his? I said, yeah, it's his birthday. Um, <laughs> Cause we were actually talking about it the other day. So let's get started with this unboxing. Um, I like mystery boxes cause it's, you know, it's always, you throw a couple bucks out there and, um, Let's let's see what we got in here. Now this is approximately about the size of a of a shoebox, so um, you know that's one thing too. If you notice, uh, we're going. Uh, I'm live here. Um, you want a taco hat? Uh, yeah. Well, he sells them. Go on to his Etsy store. Um, I got a taco T-shirt, and uh, I'm not really much of a hat. I, I like that hat more because of Mike Schmidt, but I have. Uh, Actually, yeah, do I have two taco? No, I know I have at least one taco t-shirt. Um, but this is the box. Take off the black bag. The mystery bag is bulging. She has this, I mean, it's like I don't think you could fit no more into it. So it's a it's a bulging box. Um, that's another thing I want to touch real base real quick is um, I got some shows already lined up for February. I got... Uh, Aussie Thrifters next Saturday. We're going to be doing a special episode of the Late 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 Show. And um, hold on, I got a wacky, wacky thing here that just popped up on my screen. I don't know why. It says teams. I don't know, not know what's going. Hold on again. 
having little technical difficulties here. This is Microsoft Teams. Why? Yeah, but why is it popping up? <laughs> yeah, well, that's a new thing. Uh, yeah. And we got lights flickering here above me. Hold on. So we're having, having a little bit of a light show here. If you see that, I have a light that's flickering above me. Hold on. All right. I just unwound the bulb. It was driving me nuts. There's a, uh, there's one, two, three, six, and little things like that. Will uh, no, we're we're John Jones. We're not back to the lobby. We're here. Little things like that just drive me nuts. Tapping, you know, flick, you know, my kid, I know when we're driving, he'll be playing with the window or tapping on the, you know, and I'm like, will you knock it off? But um, we are having, a, that's what I was talking about, next Saturday at 6 o'clock Saturday. Hello from Pottsville, Pennsylvania. Oh, thank you. I'm up here in uh, Lake Wall and Paul Pack, so thank you for stopping. Uh, Aussie Thrifters. Um, is going to be on the show. So we're going to have a special edition of Brad and Jazz will be on 6 o'clock my time, but it's their time in Australia is 9.30. And then Destiny I'm going to be doing a show with, The Treasure Hustlers on my birthday, Misty, uh, Vintage, uh, Thrifter, Hunter, something like that, and a couple of Pickers is going to be on too. So I'm going to start doing more lives once or twice a week again, and and um, it's it's blurry again? Really? It's not showing. Uh, see, on my phone, it looks clear. Is it? Is it blurry? Oh, man, I'm getting aggravated with this. And I may have to just up uh, to kind of get the because I don't know if it's just the, the it can't handle it fast enough or because there's too much trying to use the internet in the house but uh, um, it looks clear does it how, what do you guys is it frozen oh my gosh really mm 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 uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm not logged into YouTube, so now I'm trying to see. Oh, it's fine now? Yeah. All right. Now my it says it's fine now. All right, yeah, I can see it on YouTube. I'm sorry, guys, about that, but it says it looks looks fine. Okay. I don't know. Well, we do have bad a little bit of bad weather going on here, but um, like I said, StreamYard is supposed to be that, the, you know, it, and, I, and I've done this before, so this ain't my first time, but um, – I don't know what's going on, um, you know. Of course, now the phone's got to ring, so th this is what. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, guys. We're getting phone calls. The, the thing. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's get to the mystery box opening. So, <clears throat> all right, here we go, guys. Let's see what our first item is. All right. First item out of the box is a Mickey t-shirt from disney i mean that alone right there is worth about 15 dollars. so that's that's nice size large i can give that to my wife so that's nice so that's the first item out of the box yeah the sound is back i had to mute it uh somebody called on the phone a uh, mickey <coughs> train 
Now, you know, she so like that. So that's that's nice. That's that's two items so far. Let me mark this down. Uh, we got a hat. Wow, she looks like she basically put me uh, a, a Disney package together. We got a nice hat, Disney World, uh, the vintage characters. True vintage characters. That's a nice hat. So that's three items. Oh, okay. I think you know what it is? That other piece is part of a train. That's cute. So it's a whole train set with the three. Now, see this stuff like this. It, you know, Donna makes uh, – if you watch Donna or T, they do auctions, and I've been on their show where we make up reseller lots. This is stuff that I'll personally keep. Oh, okay. Here's a mini Mouse hand. There we go. Yes, guys, if you could, you know, how you want to sub to one another is hit the three dots to the right, and you guys can, um, yeah, I like Disney stuff. I was just down there, and, um, yeah, I, I like, I love Walt Disney World. I've been there eight times in the last, like, 20 years, but um, you guys hit the three dots to the right and sub to one another. Yeah, basically, I think this is a Disney box. <clears throat> Here's a, a Mickey Mouse towel, nice, and and uh, um, yeah, that's nice too. You know, her, uh, Donna being in Florida, she has access when she buys storage units to all this stuff. So that's an that's another nice item. I, that's one, two, three, four. I'm gonna count the train as one item, even though there's three. Um, oh, here's a Mickey Mouse. Animal Kingdom. This I think this is yeah McDonald's, two thousand and nine, um, Mickey glass. That's very nice. The detail on that. Hey, just me, Kathy. What's up, neighbor, honey? How are you doing? How's the weather down in your area? If you guys just came in, I am doing a mystery box opening from Donatella, and I did some fan mail. And uh, I talked about Taco Stacks, his birthday today. So if you guys get a chance, go over there and wish Taco happy birthday. Oh, wow. Look at this. Now, this is a pink glittery glittery hat. That's pretty. The sequence hat. I can't wear that, but my head's too big or yeah, to fit that. But look at that. Reminds me of like a disco ball. So that's one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, seven items so far in this mystery box. Um, is this Dory? What's the blue fish? Dory. Dory. Yeah, here's Dory. Now, how's it? I think it's a, oh, it's a bank. It's a plush Dory bank. Yeah, that would, uh, uh, it's, that's Disney, the sequence hat. Oh, yeah, 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 you're right, because it has uh, Mickey ears on the back. You're right. It's cute. So I got a, a nice uh, – honestly, not sold. It is about eight to ten years down the road is to probably live part-time in Florida and then have a house uh, down there. Uh-oh. Now I've got another bag in here. I don't know what's in here. Here I got a nice knife, pocket knife, Winchester. That's nice. That's very nice. So that's a nice uh, Winchester pocket knife. Uh oh, I don't know what's in here. That is, looks like so, oh, some sort of. Uh, oh, maybe it's a necklace. Yeah, there you go. 
it's a necklace or some, some sort of a jingly necklace. So I made out, I made out pretty good. I want to thank you, Donna. I appreciate the effort that you put in, in, uh, putting this box together for me and, and knowing what I like and kind of th themed it that way. But I have a lot, uh, so basically nine items. So, um, Oh yeah, I was thinking that too. Uh, it was a sort of a belt too, but I, I wasn't sure. So in the shoe box, mystery box that I got from her, she had she had the box packed. So uh, nine items uh, fit in there. Again, thank you, Donna. It was great. I appreciate it. All this stuff, everything in here is I'm going to keep for myself, and um, you know, add to my personal collection. And one day I like to have some sort of display shelf. I want to put the stuff back. Some, you know, it's it's like a puzzle. Sometimes you can't get it back to you. So I'm trying to get everything, how she got everything in here, I don't know. Because <clears throat> I can't get, I'm struggling to get everything back in here. Yeah. So I'm going to have to get a different size box. Uh, but th this is even nice, the, the, the Disney glass. Oh, it's, I thought it said 2009. It's actually 2000. See? Yeah. Yeah, you should go to Don go to Donatella and tell her that you want a mystery box. Um, I bought four of them off of her, and I told her whenever you get them ready, send them together. This was the third one um, that I opened now from her, and uh, I should be getting one probably next month sometime for her. But she's busy and stuff, so I don't worry about getting it right away. And, um, you know, once she gets to know you, and, like, you know, I think it was Judgment Care Steve, he said to her, oh, I don't want no clothes. So she she won't send him clothes. And, hey, Grimes Finds, what's up, buddy? How are you? Welcome back. You were um, – I know you were in New York. Oh, thank you, Darlene. Um, I, I was watching your video and stuff like that. And um, uh, your wife, Gina, and Katie did a good job on their premiere the other day. I was with Taco Stacks uh, <clears throat> doing storage units, and I was watching it in between. Um, so I, I, I did catch, um, you know, the, the premiere. So I uh, hope everything's going good for you down there in Texas. So thank you for stopping in. I appreciate it. Is that a windshield heat cover thingy? Uh, what's he talking about? Not sure what he's talking about. <clears throat> so I appreciate everybody stopping by. I don't know what's what your plans are this weekend. I'm gonna I'm gonna start making more videos. I I've, I've kind of been but uh oh the screen behind you. Uh no no no. Hey bluegrass picker, thanks for stopping in. It's it's just a regular um regular backdrop that I just got. Um, got a Donatella. Thank you. Um, Connie, you're getting a, a mystery box. Yes. Grimes again. Thank you for stopping in. So, um, if you guys could hit the thumbs up, I'm actually, I'm, I'm trying to persuade Grimes and, uh, I keep busting his chops, um, about sending me a Grimes finds mystery box so that I can do an unboxing. Uh, Grimes, if you missed it, if you came in late, you could go back for the last about 10 minutes. I unboxed a mystery box from uh, Donatella. It was all themed Disney, uh, which was very nice. So if you want to check that out, go back and uh, watch Pat D's for 10 minutes. Uh, I'd appreciate it. So, But um, that's, all. I, that's all I wanted to show you. If you guys, I will... I won't be on T tonight. If T wants to post her link in there, T's going to have an auction tonight at 8 o'clock. I want you guys, uh, T and Donna have been very supportive of me, and we try to support each other. If you guys want to check out T tonight, I think it's 8 o'clock. She's going to do uh, auctions. Um, if you guys could uh, – T, if you want to post your link in there, um, you can um, – Go and check out tea tonight. Oh, you were watching? Oh, all right. Thank, thanks, Justin. I appreciate that. Um, laugh out loud. Should be in the form of a shape. I, I don't care what Grimes would send me. 
I don't care if it would be little corny stuff, postcards, different mixes of things, just to kind of let him use his mind and, and decide what he wants to send to me. Uh, it, it would be appreciated. And I, I, and I pay for it. I'm not asking for, uh, for, for free. I do buy these uh, mystery lots. I don't ask for free ones. Um, he's just got to let me know, hey, Pat, this is what I can do for $30 or $35. Uh, I will not be on any auctions this week. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I kind of think I know what that means. <laughs> um, I had to be a little bit. I, I sent uh, Gina a message the other day. I had to be a little bit of a mod in your uh, live the other day. There was a little bit of an issue, so I, I hopefully took care of that. And, um, you know, I always, uh, yeah, I get it. That's what I thought. But, um um, anytime, buddy. I appreciate, you know, um, I've been Grimes. I've been following him. I actually met him through Jeremy. What the hell's and, and, you know, back when I think he had like 4,000. So it's good to see he he's really, uh, taking YouTube by storm and, and pushing his channel and growing. I think last check was 26,000. He, and he collabs with a lot of people and stuff like that. And he, he's a busy man. So, um, I appreciate it. So, um, Grimes has actually been on my channel too before stuff, and I hope one day, as his um, time allows, he'll he'll be back on again, even if he's only hanging out for ten minutes. And uh, I appreciate the support and stuff like that. So we got thirty-one people in here watching right now. I appreciate it, guys. Um, that was the mystery unboxing. I actually got a box coming from T um that she i bought one item and she threw some stuff in there too so maybe i'll do something with that and chris the goose is going to be on with t tonight and i think paul and lisa and uh, uh the items the tools that i got the rusty like old wrenches and stuff like that i got from chris the goose just came in today so i'm gonna i'm gonna be doing um on, on that so um you know uh, i gotta but i gotta get back out there and start um filming and doing some different things. Um, um, I, I'm just following the chat. So I appreciate everybody stopping in. I appreciate the support. Again, if you guys are, are just here, I want you to help me out. I want to remind people, go over to Taco Stacks. Uh, uh, I was with Taco Stacks this week, and he gave me this free ball cap. He knows I like Mike Schmidt. And go over and wish him today is his birthday. So go over and wish wish him happy birthday and tell him that Pat D sent you. And I do that as a favor to me, and I greatly appreciate it, guys. Uh, I hope I see you guys more often. I am going to be doing one to two lives a week, and um, um, you'll, I'll be putting out more pre-recorded content as now the weather, and I'm starting to feel better. So thank you, guys. Thanks for stopping in. Hey, Justin, thanks again for stopping in. I know you're a busy man, buddy. Uh, I appreciate it. T, thank you for being a great friend. And Donna, thanks again. And um, um, Just Me Kathy is my neighbor. I'm going to stay on her. We're, she dumpster dives. We're going to come and we're going to meet up this year and do some dumpster diving together. So thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Have a great day. And uh, God bless. Bye-bye.